India's space ambitions are soaring. The country is aiming to send its astronauts to the International Space Station. A select set of astronauts are slated to train with the U.S. space agency, NASA. What does this mean for India? ISRO Chief S. Somananth spoke exclusively to Weon's Siddharth MP on this and more. Watch. What will be the tangible outcome? So once uh, one of our own astronauts or perhaps two of them fly to the ISS, what will be the tangible outcomes and how does it uh, positively impact the development of Gaganyan's program and uh, the progress of Gaganyan? Uh, what you said precisely, that is a goal. Uh, we must be able to get more and more inputs on the development of Gaganyan and utilization of the Gaganyan for the future. See, I look at it from the point of view of Gaganyan becoming a global route for human spaceflight. If it has to happen, then it must get international accreditation in a manner. Uh, they must all certify, yes, Gaganyan is a good mission, and the people who have done it are the experts in that domain. And uh, our people also, an international play, uh, a traveler also can travel in one of our Indian uh, craft, possibly to international space station or future space stations, which we are, we and others are going to build. Or possibly our Gaganyan can be used for crew and uncrew and cargo transportation for international users on a commercial basis. If all of this has to happen, we cannot do it in isolation. It has to be done as, as, as in a collaborative manner. Everybody must be a part of it. They must also get exposed. Mm -hmm. So this is one, one of the goals. Gaganyan should become a global you know, identity. So with that, when our astronauts travel in international space stations and then do such work, that connection will happen. For all the latest news, download the Wii on app and subscribe to our YouTube channel.